To change the section of a parameter or a treatment, you'll notice that you cannot change the section in the drop-down menu. Changing the section for a parameter depends on if your practice management system is integrated with SmartFlow. If your practice management system is not integrated, you will have to create a new parameter of the same name with the updated section choice. Then, delete the original parameter under the old section so it does not get used. If your practice management system is integrated with SmartFlow, you will first need to unmap the EMR item from the SmartFlow parameter with the same name. For this, double-click the item in the parameters table. In the editing pop-up window, press the X near the name of the EMR item to clear the EMR name, and then press Update. Then, go back to the parameters table and search under the EMR name column for the item name, which should have no name in the SmartFlow display name column. Double-click the item from the EMR column, and in the window that pops up, you will be able to click on the drop-down list and select which section you would like the parameter to be under. Next, ensure the rest of the information is correct before clicking Save. Once you've remapped the parameter to your SmartFlow inventory, make sure you go back and delete the extra parameter with the same SmartFlow name, 